J Caddy Beast from Phoenix, Arizona, and you're watching Hot Facts with my boy Robert Reese. Hot Facts with Robert Reese, y'all. Doing a little drive right now. I'm about to take this time to respond uh, to a video. Young Ant Hefe. You know what I'm saying? He out there running them checks up, doing his thing. And um, I'm, re I'm responding to him because I tagged him in the video and I knew that he hot right now. Pick up on the right. He got a lot of stuff going on right now. He talking about a lot of stuff right now and people was listening. So while this whole, you know, peace talk and everything is going on with Crips and everything in LA, I did a video and I'd put my little two cents in. Now I got families, family members from all over. Okay. So uh Big Keita, okay, from the four O's, okay. Uh his son is like my first cousin, okay? Fodies right there, okay? Um Keita's baby mom, my cousin, okay. Her twin brother from IVC. His son from Phi Deuce. Now, my mom, my uncles, my uncles, original Crips. Okay? East side, west side Crips, original. We got family branched off. I got people on the red side, people in Pacoima, Compton. I'm by way of Paramount, Northside, Long Beach. I got family all over. We got family in the Rift, East Coasts, all over. And I got family that's been beefing, you know, or they sections beef, but they really don't, you know, they don't beef like that, they family. And so I didn't see the worst of the worst of it over stupid stuff. Now he put my video out. I'm Hot Facts with Robert Reese. It's me. He put the video out because he didn't understand or you didn't understand why I sent you that. You've been getting a lot of uh, getting a lot of the hidden jewels and putting them out there. The reason why I put that video out there, because as you see, you got these two old dudes. And one of them come to find out is producers that we work with. One of his uncles. All right. Small world. And with that being said, right, right there, they arguing over some bullshit. He said 40 years of this shit over some bullshit. I put the video out there to show you that. And I wanted you to go ahead and pick up on that. Like, that's what it can turn into. It could turn into you ain't making no money off of it. You um, was going uh, what's going on is you ain't making no money off of it. You get old, you start doing other stuff with the gang, smoking, getting all turned out, but then you repping it so hard like that, but you ain't doing nothing. And that's how it looked. It looked old, pointless, stupid. You got people that drive up all over the place and looking at, oh, look at these black dudes out there. Look at these black dudes out there. Just look at them. They out there doing it. They over there beefing over nothing. Now, it's a lot of shooters out there that's been shooting over nothing. I didn't have my house shot up, cocktail, everything. I remember when the truce in 9 Deuce in 92, what happened? My brotherhood over there. I got cousins hoods all over there. They mixing in, doing their thing. And it worked for like a little bit. And then the police got involved. They did this and that. And it just did not work. It went all the way back to how it used to be. Now, there were relationships made during that peace tre treaty, during that truce, to where some dudes still get along to this day. The people that shot up my house, coincidentally, I got a niece out the situation. Looters Park and Lime Hood, Pyru, they came through and shot up the house. And... My brother was messing with, you know, a sister there, and I got a niece out the situation. And crazy thing is, both sides kind of, you know, eased up and everything, you know. 
And that was a little truth right there. They was like, oh, that's the dude that lived right there. He lived in the neighborhood because we stayed in their hood. Then once that came out, our house got shot up. But then a niece came out of it and it was all good. But some peace and truth did come out of that. Now, everybody is older and ain't nobody really own that because young ones lives are the ones at stake there. So it's a little bit different. OK, they learn something. I tagged you to let you see that so people can see that. Look, if dudes don't want to go along with no peace or no just cease fire or nothing or just no let's not squabble or nothing. You're going to end up, you know, growing up and looking like these two dudes right here. Or that you saw. The reason I put that up there is to show you that, look. You got people that's talking about peace. You got people saying there ain't no peace. And then you got old people that's out of their element still doing that. Now, that video was 11 months old. OK, that video was 11 months old. And I was like, man, now's the time to just 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 repost it. And all I did was tag you. I tagged Slim and I tagged Milk. Uh, right now, you hot right now. You're getting 40, 50,000 views of video, everything else there. And you sit up there talk, talk, talking about, hey, um, if I get it, I'm going to put it up. You know, it's about that check. But it was a deeper message in between that. That. They talking about this piece because they got homies that's out there that look like them. Some of them dudes are still acting like they young shooters out there in the game and they popping this and popping that and they look like crackheads on the street. We want to clean that up too. We want to clean it up. We want to just clean it up. I want to put that video out there for you. So you can just see that's how ridiculous this look. He was like, he was like, I don't know why he even sent me this. Why he even tagged me in that? It's a message behind it. That's what it looked like. If we could put a ceasefire and things like that, start helping each other out, maybe them brothers wouldn't be out there doing that. That was the whole purpose of the video. The whole purpose of the video. And I put it out there and I knew you was go play it on your channel because you own one right now. That was the only reason. Cause that's how crazy it looked. I'm Hot Facts, y'all. I'm the channel that he said. He said it came from a podcast named Hot Facts with Robert Reese. That's me. Put that out there for a reason. But go check out my video on what I feel about the peace talks. It's up there.